I went to London. I mean, I started psychology here and I wanted to uh, uh, learn about hypnosis. That's why I went to London, yeah. because uh, at that time in Bulgaria, to learn hypnosis, to, 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 uh, uh, yeah, to, yeah. to start the, the hypnosis, you had to be a medical doctor. Yes, you can't just do it like this. Yeah. As a psychologist, you couldn't at that time. Yes. Not now, of course. But So I said, okay, I'm going to go. And study. I'm, I'm going somewhere else. And of course, I, was, I had a crush on Lady Diana. So <laughs> I, just, I said to myself, okay, England it is then. It's a good sign, yeah. Absolutely. So I went there with 50 pounds. I went there, 50 pounds in my pocket. I went there. Um, and uh, two months, I slept on a Brighton beach. <laughs> slept on a beach. I didn't have nothing to eat. Uh, I was uh, eating from the, um, uh, from the trash. Uh, but um, never in my experience, when I was feeling low, 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 I thought, God, I gotta have, to, I, I need to quit. I mean, because at that time it was bad because I was sleeping rough. I was sleeping on the streets. I was sitting uh, crap from the trash. But um, I knew that I want to go somewhere, and I knew that if I gave up now, it's not gonna happen, and I wouldn't feel good with myself. So the. You, back then, even then, you had this trait of yourself, not giving up, going for what you Absolutely. want. Which is what you need now for the, for the ultra Absolutely. I, I think yes. that's a kind of gradual process yes. that it happened. And I discovered more as, as I survived. Because, I mean, you, you, you know London, you know the big cities. It's not easy to survive in a massive capital where, uh, where London, London can be very, it's an amazing city, but can be very lonely yeah. if you don't know anybody. So, like, once I st I, uh, then I got a job, I started studying, I, I started, uh, literally things started happening to me, uh, for me.